ghosts and people. Don't forgive me. Just take the money and get out of here. Please. I know I ruined your life. I suffer for it every day. But don't let yourself get killed for, for pride. I've seen it kill too many folk. I had a son. He passed away. I had a girl who loved me. I threw that away. My mama died when I was a kid. And my daddy. Well, I watched him die. I watched soon enough. I'm dying, sister. Okay. Now I got TB. I got it. Beating the man to death. <clears throat> For a few bucks. <sighs> I've lived a bad life, sister. We've all lived bad lives, Mr. Morgan. We all sin. What am I gonna do now? Be grateful that for the first time. You see your life clearly. <laughs> sure. Perhaps you could help somebody. Help him makes you really happy. <sighs> but I still don't believe in nothing. <laughs> Often neither do I. <laughs> but then I meet someone like you, and everything makes sense. You're too smart for me, sister. <laughs> I guess I... I'm afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of, Mr. Morgan. Take a gamble that love exists and do a loving act. There's a good man within you, Arthur. But he is wrestling with a giant. And the giant wins time and again. You keep killing folk, don't you? I'm just trying to make sure that some of us survive Arthur. Now, shall we proceed? Listen, <clears throat> son, you think I want any of this? I don't know. Of course I don't. But I made a pledge to you all. We would survive, no matter what. But we're all gonna die, Agent. Some of us, sooner than others. Arthur. Arthur saved my life before he passed. Oh. Talk about him much. But I think about him. <laughs> 